Ljubljana is the cultural and economic heart of Slovenia. Built on the river Ljubljanica, it has numerous museums and galleries and is host to many arts festivals. Over the past few years, people have started to feel that the city has become too focused on the use of cars. With too many cars, the urban environment has become uninviting. There is heavy traffic and this puts people off walking or cycling in the city. To increase the city's understanding of possible solutions, Luka Miladenovic of the Slovenian Urban Planning Institute became an astute associate by attending a three-day training program in London in December 2008. The training focused on successful walking and cycling initiatives achieved under astute, as well as looking at best practice examples of broader mobility management in urban areas. Already the city has undertaken some major initiatives, including the extension of the original car-free area to make many more streets car-free. There was a lot of discussion about it because um, people had their habits um, that had to be changed. Um, but I think a few months after it happened, everybody was happy, everybody was really satisfied. The issue of where to site the garbage bins was solved with a clever and innovative design. So the bins were installed underground and there is just a small box overground where you put your garbage and uh, once a week a truck comes and empties um, everything so that the whole environment there stays intact. It's nice, it's nicely designed and the bins are out of the site. We got new spaces to walk, um, city started living anew so I think the general experience is very positive. In another initiative, public areas have been transformed by urban space architects Prostoroz, using sculptures and exhibitions to add interest and enjoyment. We would like to emphasize that the public places are important and that people should meet more there and should do different kind of things. So we are trying to uh, do our projects uh, in a way that we are um, adding some um, equipments like seats or cha uh, chairs and hanging mats or actually once we put boats on the river. It's really a positive initiative um, to show us what we have, um, what we are missing every day if we're just running through the city on our everyday business.